Good morning, Alma Mess. Before we get started, let's hand it over to your pledge. Hey LMMS, it's Vivian and today is day 5, Thursday, April 11th and these are your student announcements. The Multicultural Club meets today after school. Today is the last day to buy Tokyo birthday stickers and Scooby snacks. The Creators Studio will meet in room 504 Tuesday after school. Be sure to sign up for the late bus and bring anything you are currently working on. 6th and 7th grade girls interested in possibly playing field hockey should attend an informational meeting in the office side LGI next Thursday during 9th period. Our PTO is having a fundraiser at Drizzle on Thursday, April 25th from 3 to 9 p.m. 15% of all sales will go directly to our school. Last chance to paint with Pomeran, April 30th and May 2nd. You need to attend both days. See posters for more info. Sign up with Mrs. Pomeran in room 415. Donations are needed for the 8th grade semi-formal pop-up shop. Please bring items to the library by May 6th. We are looking for dresses, button-down shirts, polos, dresses, shoes, suits, dress pants, jackets, ties, jewelry, and belts. 8th grade semi-tickets are on sale for $15. See your team leaders. Price increase is on May 1st. That's all for me. Now into your world news. Good morning, LMMS. I'm Paisley, and this is your World News Update for today. From a small Vermont countryside community comes a story of Jonathan and Natalie who ditched mowing their massive lawn and planted wildflowers instead, delighting the neighbors, birds, bees, and butterflies. They've steadily grown their wildflower meadow for two and a half acres, which has become so popular that it's inspired others nearby to do the same. So, LMMS, what do you think about this? That's all for me, and I'll turn it over to your weather news. MMS, it's Kayla here with your weather news. Today's high will be 68 with a low 53 and rainy. Tomorrow's high will be 63 with a low 50 and cloudy. Looks like the weather is finally cooling down. Hey LMMS, why couldn't the flower ride its bike? It lost its petals. That's all for me. Now on over to your sports news. Good morning, LMMS. It's Ava here with your sports news. As many of you know, the 2024 Summer Olympics will be held in Paris, France. Track and field will be the first Olympic sport to introduce prize money. The Olympics said that they would pay $50,000 to gold medalists in Paris. It is said that $2.4 million was set aside for the winners. There are 48 different events on the track and field for this year's Olympics. So, LMMS, what do you think about this new prize money? That's all for me. Now into your entertainment news. Good morning, LMMS. It's Natalie here with your entertainment news update for the day. Today, we are going to be looking at some top movies released so far this year, 2024. First up is Civil War, a movie about a dystopian version of future America. In the movie, journalists race against time to reach D.C. to warn of a rebel army. This movie stars Kirsten Dunst. Another movie is Godzilla vs. Kong, A New Empire. This movie is about a colossal threat hidden deep in the planet, with Godzilla and Kong having to band together to face this threat. This movie stars Kaylee Hoddle. The last movie I have for you is Kung Fu Panda 4, which is about the main character Po training a new ninja warrior, facing many troubles along the way. This movie stars Jack Black. Have you watched any of these movies, Alma Mess? That's all for me, and now on over to your segment for the day.
that's all for Buzz TV. Have a great day, LMMS.